kind of become part of the nature. Yo! Kota, where are we going? <laughs> Hey. Hey, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Which train? This one? Okay, okay. <laughs> that doesn't look like Tokyo anymore. Well, but we're still in Tokyo. Is this still Tokyo? Yes, yes. <laughs> is there, is there a, a McDonald's around here? So we can, <laughs> so we can eat McDonald's again. <laughs> You know, you go out in the countryside, they have proper sized beer here or something. <laughs> <laughs> it's bigger than my face, man. Yeah, it's bigger than your face, yeah. Fantastic. Two liters. What's my money? I bought a rich green tea. <laughs> Where the hell are we? Look at this. There's not even like any city anymore on this map. It's beautiful. Yeah. And we have to get on this bus. We have to get on this bus. So we are somewhere here. Mada Tokyo. <laughs> Still Tokyo? Yeah. Uh, Tokyo Prefecture. So like it's like right between Tokyo and Saitama. So right. We're about to go to and send it's a then temple to have a waterfall practice it's one of the ways to do meditation and uh, it's going to be done underwater basically the purpose is to purify your mind through meditation but you actually go into the water you know get hit by the water okay. and you kind of become part of the nature one with the water. It's like, yeah. So you, you know, become Aquaman. <laughs> Essentially. Essentially, yes. Emergency toilet. Toilet visit. You ready? Haye! Nanka hayai. So the website description says we have to go and walk five minutes up this mountain and uh, if you ask me that's like five minutes too much in like 30 plus degree Celsius. You kind of become part of the nature. It's gonna be fantastic. At least I'm gonna take a shower later in the waterfall. So there's that. Sorry, I was taking some pictures. You are great, remember? <laughs> you are great. <laughs> you are so great. If 
feels like, you know, one of those death cults that they, 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 they killed themselves, you know, <laughs> drink poison and then dress into some white clothes before. <laughs> Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. I'm a big guy, I need a big towel. I was really worried about that. I thought, you know, you're thinking like, ah, oh, it's okay, it's just gonna, like, you're just let me party. Yeah, but... This is gonna be a huge thing. But even if I, if I didn't bring a towel in like five minutes, I'm dry. It's so hot. <laughs> it's actually not humid today. So that's... That's how we ended up. Why you on it? What do you guys think? Super excited. <laughs> Super excited. <laughs> Become someone new. <laughs> Who do you want to be? Natalie Portman? Someone with no sin. <laughs> Okay. 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 Okay.
取るよセバスタン風呂じゃねえから<笑>風呂入ってんじゃねえからそれ<笑>よかったよ声出てた声しっかり出てたセバスチャンはここすごい持ちこたえてた<笑>流されなかった<笑>俺あいつそう思えればマイスはあかんアビプペルウォッシュアウェイ You find your new cell. Come right there. What the hell? 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 Zero percent body fat. My favorite shape. So whenever I go to the mountains, I go hiking, I do this kind of activity, I feel like eating soba. What do you think? I agree, I agree. So let's go. We found a good place here. Let's go eat some soba. I'm super hungry. Let's go. Let's go.
you know you're in the Japanese countryside when you have to press a button to open the door. <laughs> what a fantastic experience. I'm now back in Shibuya and my friends had to get off the train a little bit earlier. But I'm sure they would have told you the same thing, that this was absolutely outstanding, unique experience. Actually, there's a bus stopping behind me right now. Maybe I need to change places again. So what was I saying? It's an absolutely unique experience. Um, fantastic to have the chance to do this. As you can see in the video, uh, I'm the only foreigner who went there. And it's definitely something completely different compared to my usual everyday life here in the middle of Tokyo, especially here in Shibuya. Yeah, if you are tired of the big city, if you need to purify your soul, you want to get a little bit away from everything, it's definitely a once in a lifetime experience. I know it's once in a lifetime for me, but that was, that was fucking cold. And I'm, I'm not sure if I would who want to repeat this. I feel like purified enough for at least a couple of years. Uh, maybe in the future I'll do something similar at some other place. But I'll put some links down below. Um, I got them sent from my buddy. I'll put them down below for you so you can actually go and book this for yourself. You'll probably need some help from a Japanese person because everything is in Japanese and also all the instructions are in Japanese. So unless you're super fluent, um, I would recommend going there with at least one Japanese person who can actually like explain what's going on, what's going to happen, what you need to do. Um, the monk that is there, even though he doesn't look like or he's not dressed in his robes, uh, he's actually quite strict about the things that you have to do. So if you don't do it in the right order, he'll tell you to uh, do it again and go back into the water, for example. But that's just what it is. I mean, you have to follow the traditions if you want to do something traditional. So that's all for today. I hope you like this video. And uh, if you want me to make more of these kinds of videos, let me know in the comments. If you like this video, click like. Subscribe if you want to see more and be notified uh, once I upload new videos. Please do so and I see you in the next one. So this is probably the cutest bus I've ever been on.